Today we are making a time machine from Back to the Future. This is the DMC DeLorean that was converted with a flux capacitor. As many people know from the movie Back to the Future, if it travels um, 88 miles per hour, it can probably time travel. <laughs> and it leaves these fire trails in the back. And I have uh, two versions here. This is like the regular version, I guess. It has um, this Mr. Fusion, which you can put like garbage in it and that converts into fuel. And then over here, this one is actually a bit different. It has this extra thing on top. And it's also using train track wheels so it can travel. In Back to the Future 3, they had to travel on these old train tracks to the present day train tracks. And then it was hit by an actual train. And I did want to make an animation at one point. So I actually had some designs for the DeLorean back then. Uh, but then, you know, over time, I just left it alone. And now I just started working on it again. I'm glad that I waited because this design is a lot better than whatever I came up with like a few years ago. And uh, yeah, there's two versions of it, as I said, and I have like different license plate. And I'm not like a Back to the Future expert or anything, so I don't know if this is exactly accurate or not, but they do have different license plate. This is supposed to be like just the regular one, and then this one's like a futuristic uh, barcode one with the Acacia sign, so that's gonna be different. But yeah, let's get started on this build. So first off, let's grab some materials. I'm gonna take out a polished andesite slab, um, smooth stone slab, Polished deep slate slab, nether brick stairs, stone button, polished andesite stairs, black concrete, a withered skeleton skull, as well as a polished black stone brick slab. And that's all we could fit in our hot bar right now. So first off in the front, we're going to add in three blocks wide of this polished andesite slabs. Then behind, we're going to add another one here. Then we'll add in nether brick stairs upside down facing inside like this for the wheels. In the front corners we'll add in smooth stone slab with polished deep slate slab here in the middle. Three blocks wide polished and sight slabs. And then make a T-shape of black concrete. And then we'll add in polished um, and sight slab down here on uh, both sides. And then we're going to add in uh, these three blocks long polish andesite stairs upside down. Other side, same thing. One, two, and three. Then we're going to add in upside down nether brick stairs. Going to be our back wheels. And then we'll add in polished black stone brick um, slab. We're going to make a T shape like this. Then we'll add in polished andesite stairs, just two of them. And we're going to corner the back one just like that. Then we'll add in stone buttons to the sides of all of our wheels. And we're going to add a block temporarily here next to the windshield and add in this wither skeleton skull for the side view mirror. All right, next up, we're going to add in a chain, light gray carpet, and this cobbled deep slate, as well as this deep slate tile wall. So first we'll put the deep slate tile wall here, then the cobbled deep slate. And then we'll add in a chain in front of the mirror, both sides. Then we'll add in a light gray carpet, three blocks wide. Stone bun on the roof here. And then we'll also take out a dark oak sign, birch sign, dark oak fence gate, a polished black stone brick wall, as well as a dark oak trap door. So first off, we'll place down a pair of polished black stone brick walls with dark oak trap doors behind it, close them up. And underneath the trap doors, we'll add in dark oak fence gates, open them both up. And then uh, right here in the middle, actually, it's going to be a polish, um, I guess, deep slate slab there. And then that burst sign like that. Also burst signs here on the sides of it. Also add in a dark oak sign up over, above the wheel, both sides. And then a chain right in front of that sign on uh, both sides, just like that. All right, it's looking good so far. Then we're gonna add in this turtle egg and that's gonna be our Mr. Fusion right on top of this wall. Just like that, we just need one turtle egg. And then down here, we'll add in a polished andesite block uh, right in between where we have the other polished andesite right there in the middle. And I think we'll do the same thing over in the back. Although you can't really see the underside of this. So I don't know if you exactly need to add it, 
But let's just add it anyways like that. Just so it's evened out. Alright, so cool. This is how you make the regular uh, Back to the Future DeLorean. Now, we're going to convert it if you do want to make this other version of it with like the train wheels. And also I'll teach you how to make the fire. The eternal fire if you want to that doesn't like go out. And that could be the fire trail. So first off, we'll get a campfire. doesn't really matter which one. So we just delete this block here, put that inside. And then we'll grab a bucket and a water bucket. First, put out the fire with the water. Take out the water with a regular bucket. Then we'll go in the back. We'll change this license plate into an Acacia sign instead. And we will also delete the wheels here, all of them. And we're going to replace them with this grindstone wheel and um, we want to make sure it's facing the right direction so let me see it should be looking like that for our train wheels I guess you just face this way and then the last two wheels alright and then this one alright so once we have added all the wheels um, I think that should be pretty much it for this one. And now I'll teach you how to make the fire trails. So if you don't know, um, to make the fire eternal, you can use nether rack. You could get this from the nether, it's pretty cheap. Um, and you would just make the trails however long you want. So we'll just put them on the back of this like that. And then we're gonna make it so, I kinda like split it apart just to make it more random. Uh, but if you want to, you could just have solid lines. It doesn't really matter. It's your uh, personal preference. So we'll just make this first line, you know, five blocks long like this. Other line, five blocks long as well. And skip one, two, skip one, looks like three. And then skip two, add one here. While on the other side, it's going to be skip one, four. And then skip one, two, skip one, one, like that. And then we need to light it up, so get our flint and steel, or whatever fire setting material you want. And we just light this nether rack on fire, and it should stay on fire forever. Um, and yeah, that's actually uh, pretty much it on how to make the Back to the Future DMC DeLorean in Minecraft. I hope you guys enjoyed the build. And if you do, remember to hit that like button down below, subscribe if you haven't already, check out our Minecraft and Discord server. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.